Hi, it's Mr. T again with another tutorial on exponential growth. In this case, we have, as said here, bacteria cells, and we're, we know that this particular bacteria, the number of cells double every eight hours. And we used a microscope and counted our initial number of uh, bacteria cells in our experiment, and we had 250 cells. And we want to know how many cells do we expect to have in five days. So we're going to use our general model again here for exponential growth. Y equals a b to the x power. Uh, in this case, we have our initial amount, which is a. Doubling is going to give us our b, so b is going to equal 2. But we have to be careful here when we can't figure out our x, the number of times it's doubled, because we've got time as in days, and our doubling rate is in number of hours. So we're going to have to take advantage of that when we fill in our formula. So if we use c for our number of cells, we started with 250. We're doubling. Now we have to ca calculate the number of times we've doubled. So we need to figure out our total number of hours, which is 5 t days times 24 hours per day. That'll be our number of hours, and we have to divide that by 8 to figure out how many times we've doubled. So that calculation will be our uh, model for this particular problem. And uh, we can use a graphing calculator to uh, calculate that. We've got to be careful with our parentheses. So if I bring my graphing calculator in here, I have entered the amount. So here's our A times 2 and our exponent. Now we have to calculate this top calculation in a parentheses. So 5 times 24 and then divide by 8. And the entire uh, exponent here is in a set of parentheses. So if we press enter here, we get that we have 8,192,000 cells. So again, what was on the calculator when we calculated this was 8,192,000 uh, cells. Now this doesn't have to divide evenly. What if instead of our a time here of being five days, it was uh, 37 hours. Our formula will still work for that. We've got C equals 250. Two. Now we need to figure out the number of times we've doubled. So it's 37 divided by 8. And again, we'll bring our graphing calculator over to uh, calculate that. So we've got here 250 times 2 raised to the, now we need to calculate here, 37 divided by 8. Close that parentheses and press enter. And now in those th first 37 hours we will have about uh, 6,169 cells. So again, we had 6,169 cells after 37 hours. That's just a little bit more than one and a half days. Uh, finally, to wrap this up, I took our model here and put x as our number of days. So our x-axis is here, number of days. And our y-axis is in millions. So you can see our classic exponential growth for the first two or three days because of our scale. We're barely above the axis. And then around uh, day in the fourth day we start to really increase and then the cells the number of cells explode anyway uh, again on this one the key thing was our rate and our time were in different units and we needed to factor that in have a good day